The site was so remote that heavy machines couldn't be used to build it. All the work had to be done by hand. It carries 1,380 passengers an hour and all in the middle of an earthquake zone. But laser systems and escape tunnels keep the tourists safe from the seismic danger. And if you don't want to take the elevator, you can just go ahead and take the 999 stone steps. In the 1990s, word about the stunning landscape spread and soon, huge numbers of curious tourists were tramping through the delicate forests and climbing its fragile rocks. Its ecosystem was suffering. The Chinese government had to act. One of the best views of the park is from this peak. So to keep visitors under control, but still let them see the incredible natural wonder, they built this astonishing elevator half inside, half outside a huge rock face. The visible 550 feet is actually only just over half the elevator's total height. The lower 500 feet is hidden in shafts tunneled inside the cliff. And at the bottom of those is a 650 foot access tunnel leading to the main concourse. It all works smoothly now, but its creation was an epic feat of human endeavor and engineering. 